Seth, it's okay. You don't have to get too real with a teddy bear for me to buy a ticket. I want to have a baby. It's so hot in here. I am sweating. It's so hot. This review should be about a streetcar named Desire because it's so hot in here. <laughs> Ted 2, directed by Seth MacFarlane, tells the tale of John and Ted, Thunder Buddies for Life. The sequel picks up with John, who has been recently divorced and is hella mopey, and Ted, who has been recently married and is totally unhappily. To save the marriage, Ted and his wife decide to have a baby. Because when your marriage is falling apart, it's always a good idea to throw a baby in the mix, throw in some funny sperm gags, and suddenly the film takes a serious turn where Ted's human rights are called into question. Well, that escalated quickly. This film is trying to be about what it means to be human and is constantly bringing up racial injustices. Yet with all the heart this film tries to have, it's below, subpar, sometimes stereotypically racist jokes demean the whole message that McFarlane's trying to express. Humor has been used as a tool to get past uncomfortable subjects since forever. Ask Mel Brooks. He also uses musical numbers in his comedy. But when that humor fails, it kind of just comes off like you're being a giant dick. This film has some moments that glimmer about what I loved in the first film, but all in all, it just comes off really lazy. I mean, a Robin Williams joke? You can do better than that. Hi! Your face. Hi, thank you so much for watching my mostly one minute movie review. Please comment down below at what other movie reviews you would like to see, um, or what you thought about the film, or what you thought of his previous work. I thought A Million Ways to Die in the West was good. So go ahead and hate me down in the comments. Subscribe, like, comment, do what you will. Hey, Macarena. Uh. I don't know what to say. It's so hot. It's so hot in my apartment. You have no idea. Oh, it's so hot. I'm so sweaty. I'm a hot mess. Did you know that the Oxford Dictionary just added hot mess as an official word, even though it's two. Two words, because it's hot and it's mess. There's not even a hyphen there. So that's perplexing. <laughs>